Ooh, Patreon. 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 That's where the money comes from. Wow, wow, wow. Income, income, income. Income. The, the patrons, the donators. You keep us alive with your bucks. <laughs> your, your fat stacks yeah. of bucks. Speaking of keeping alive, I apologize. I will be eating a little bit. I will oh, there he is. The I don't I don't know what happened to my Discord notifications. Nathan, you know we're live, right? You saw yes. me say that? Okay. Yes. yes. Also, okay. It, it, that doesn't change the time and date. <laughs> <laughs> well, like, I'm kind of, it's, you you're know. Just, you're just a, like a minute late. And yeah. I knew it was YouTube soon, like but shooting. I just assumed I'd get like a notification ahead of time. And instead, instead what happened was it, I only, I got notification now and missed the one. That's fun. From, it was pretty fun. Did you have streamer mode on? Maybe I don't think so, but maybe. Did you have? I don't know what gamer mode activated. Maybe I had gamer mode activated. I don't know. Well, I'm sorry. Anyway, I'm we here. were just in the middle of saying how good the patrons are. Oh, if you want to well, say I anything can, about I can that, get... real quick. Yeah, y'all are pretty good. <laughs> <laughs> You're pretty good. You're freaking fine. All right. You're, Don't you're, let it go to your hey, head. No, you're 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 pretty good. Jacob has this thing where I when I say something's pretty good, he takes that as an insult. I did that. Well, when you we... could have just said very good. You could have said y'all are excellent. Yeah. Pretty good. It's it doesn't good. even. Does that fall below good on the good scale? Pretty I good, think pretty good, good is less than good. Yeah. Because it's like good. you're basically saying it's like Incredibly almost good. good. Yeah. I think it's pretty good. You think pretty good is pretty good? I think pretty good's pretty good. Yeah. <laughs> How many layers does it go? How deep? This is a Friday stream. You can just tell. It sure is. Julia's feeling under the weather, so so J two B. Yeah, let her rest. Earlier, Julia was like, I think I might skip out on the stream. And I was like, I was going to make you skip out on the stream if you didn't yeah. <laughs> volunteer to do so. So I'm glad we did this the easy way. Yeah. <laughs> so I didn't have to like knock her out with a brick, <laughs> put her in the bed. But Jay is 2B and the rest of us are here. Yeah. Now that I'm here. <laughs> now that Nathan is here. Now that I'm here. Also, <laughs> may I just point out, I'm wearing my new Secret Sleepover merch. Oh, my God. My Jukum Justin crew neck sweatshirt. Jukum Justin. So, Justin. You know, this isn't a Secret Sleepover stream, but I just wanted to show it. It's, it's kind of, it's, you know, we've wow. got half of Secret Sleepover here and Secret Sleepover is half of Drawfee. That's hosts. true. But the half people here, hosts. they're not paying to talk about Secret Sleepover. No, but they're getting, they're getting it. But they're getting it nonetheless. Um, do you have a, did you do a little doodle? Yeah, I think this sums up how I feel uh, coming in late. Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> this looks like, did you like use reference for this? No, this is off the dome. This looks like a real person's face, like. I don't know who, but like I see it and my brain like recognizes it. Yeah. Who is this? This is so funny. It's the, well, it's uh, it's like the the part of me that was like, I'm here. Hey. This <laughs> is Nathan, but he got like so nervous that his beard receded into his skin. Yeah, I, it, it, I, I, I shunked it back in like <laughs> yeah. Wolverine with his, with his claws. <laughs> Um, it's kind I... of a, it's kind of like a toothy Bill Dotrieb <laughs> a little bit. I don't even know who that is. Bill from, from King of the Hill. Bill Dotrieb. Uh, uh... Why do you know his last name? Because yeah. his name's why because are that's you, his name. Why are you addressing him by <laughs> his full name? I thought that was a real person, dude. <laughs> it is. He's real to me. His name is Bill <laughs> King of the Hill. King of, bill, the bill. king of the bill. 
I do want to say I see a lot of people in chat excited about Hades too. Oh Hades yeah, too. they were already saying that before it even started. Wow. They were just in there saying Hades too. <laughs> I'm just, I'm just always excited to see something Spencer worked on. So good. Yeah, yeah. The animation was so killer. Yeah. I was so uh, proud. What's it like for you plebs who haven't been seeing it for the past few months? <laughs> it was pretty cool. Wasn't Again, it? It was pretty cool. It was, it was pretty good. It was really cool. I didn't yeah. I didn't know it was coming. I was caught off guard. I was surprised. <laughs> and so I was pretty psyched. As soon as it came up, I was like, Spencer? Spence? Mm -hmm. Spencer, is that you? And it was. Wow. I knew and I didn't say, yeah, it's a secret, dude. <laughs> <laughs> it's called NDA. Yeah, it's called, um, <laughs> why would I tell you people? <laughs> I don't know you. <laughs> NDA stands for not dock about it. Yeah, not dock exactly. about if it. You, if you sign it, you can't dock about it. Not. My favorite, <laughs> I, do, I do love that, like, um... Spencer is just such a fucking all star in the <laughs> animation world, but there's like a group of people who just know him as the fucking avalanche guy. <laughs> <laughs> That's very true. <laughs> Which I, is also true. I frequently. Or like the snowball guy. To me, in my mind, the animation legend Spencer Wan and. The Spencer Wan that I know and talk to are like two different people. <laughs> they don't the like Spencer conflate Wan in my freaking, brain. Who freaking got you? The Spencer the Wan seltzer. who got me with a seltzer avalanche is not the same person that worked on the Hades two trailer. That that can't be true. Dull. And yet, it is dull. and yet in real life, it is dull. In I reality, refuse to believe it. <laughs> no, not talk about it. No, not talk about it. it. <laughs> um. <laughs> W uh, I'd like to draw. You should draw. I'd like to draw something. I can eat more. What are you eating? Uh, just a grilled cheese I made. <gasps> what, what kind of cheese? cheese? Um, God it's just it, the Nathan. cheese I had left over in my fridge. <laughs> so it's like some Swiss and then just like some random shredded cheese. And then Ooh, I also have some avocado. A mix. And I put a little bit of spicy mayo on the bread to give Ooh. it a little kick. Ooh. Now draw. That Are sounds you, uh, delicious. Hold on, I gotta ask more questions about the grilled <laughs> cheese. <laughs> no, I'll get beep a clock outside. <laughs> Something's backing up and it won't shut the hell up. Back that thing up. Um, Nathan's suggestions. Nathan's suggestions. It's just beeps. The suggestions is beeps. <laughs> Grilled cheese shipment <laughs> pulling up. It's Legoshi truck outside. Uh, uh, dinosaur Zagreus. That's fun. That's fun. That's something you would draw. Let's look. I don't need a reference for dinosaur, but I do need one for Zagreus. What are you bragging? I mean, hmm. Are you bragging? <laughs> Yeah. About how you don't need a dino reference? Yeah. I mean, y'all remember what happened when I drew Dinosaura. I'll never forget. So it's 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 going to be like that, I think. It's going to be very similar to that. Dinogrius. Dinogrius. Zagreus is cute. Too bad he's he got... dead now. All we care yeah. about is the new the new lady. Friendship with Zagreus ended. <laughs> I don't guess we know the new lady's name yet. We do. Or I don't at least know what it is. It's what's her face. Oh, people are saying it. Is it Melano? Melan Melanoe? Mel Melinoni? How do you pronounce it? Melanoni. Somebody spell it out for me. I take a melanoni gummy when I'm having trouble sleeping. Mel melanonin? Melioni? Mel Is it melioni or meleone? 
Melione. Melione. Hello, Olive. Meow. Meow. I got to show you all this picture that I took. I meant to send it in the Discord. Oh, my God. But when I got back, I was laying on the couch, and Joy came. She laid up so that she was, like, laying on my chest and shoulder, and her head was, like, next to my head. And she just, like, laid there and, like, stared at me in the face. <laughs> Hell, yeah. And, and I couldn't move or do anything. It was pretty cute, but also I was so hot and she wouldn't leave. I couldn't move my head. Hello, Olive. Hello, Olive. They've been acting crazy since we got back from Georgia. That makes sense. They I missed bet. you. They freaking missed they you. They freaking missed us. Like me. I've been acting crazy. Is, is that true? <laughs> Karina, has Nathan been acting crazy? I, I think mean, I think I was the the crazy one while y'all were out. Were you acting I was, crazy? I feel like I was. I was frantically just all, at all hours messaging Nathan and David, being like, "I put a new draft in the draft." <laughs> oh, for the live show video. <laughs> what are your export settings? <laughs> Which I'll, I'm going to say publicly in front of everyone. <laughs> It was so good. It was so fun. You did a great job. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> I had a great time. I just, uh, ex uh, editing is hard. It gives me a new appreciation for what uh, y'all and David do. David especially. I got chewed out by David because <laughs> of my absolute... I saw someone say like, oh, you're part of the pipeline now. I'm like, mm, the fuck I wasn't. That was the problem. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, Nathan too. <laughs> I'm glad. Well, I, I tried to be diplomatic because I knew that you had been struggling and I didn't want to just like, <laughs> and you did, and it like, it turned out fine. So I was like, yeah. there's no point in like being mad about this, but I, I was a little... I, I want to believe I didn't make anyone mad, <laughs> but it worked out. Yeah, it was fine. So, and then when you said Dave chewed you out, I was like, okay, good. Yeah, <laughs> don't worry, did. don't worry. I got, I got my little chewing out, but <laughs> hey, it got done. It got did. <laughs> it got done. I learned new things. I saw the worst waveform I've ever seen in my life. <laughs> <laughs> The, the blown <laughs> out microphones kept... from Sunday. What, <laughs> what, what, why was it every day there was something? Every day we did a yeah. live show there, there was something different wrong. Here, it's here, impossible audience, to not. you want to know a secret? We didn't fully lose Saturday's show. We lost about half of it. Because <laughs> <gasps> that was the one where the camera wasn't on. So we had no camera footage. And also the audio was as fucked up as Sundays, yeah. if not slightly more. I am completely inaudible for the first two drawings because my mic was fully off. <laughs> <laughs> and I remember like as we were so like and, and I felt like the Saturday show was like a little the energy was a little off because it was like tinted with panic on all sides. <laughs> Just an unbelievable amount yeah. of problems and the monitor was still disconnecting yeah we didn't fix that fully until sunday no <laughs> but what a, um, what a world i cannot yeah. figure out this guy's hair it's anime hair but it's not it's not work it's not looking it's not doing what i want it's not doing what i want what do you want i want it to look like how it looks in this picture that i'm looking at can I start over? <laughs> if you want to. You should take your time because Jacob's tired. Okay. Here, I can do do the animated version. It's a little Are simpler. Are going to see editor Karina more in the future? She'll be back. She just needs to like upgrade her setup and uh, to get a new computer so that uh, David and Nathan don't kill her. <laughs> <laughs> she'll either return or die yeah as is you know that, that's life dude but at least we got a good video yeah out of video it. did end end result 
was good video. Yeah, we take those. Here we go. And I did not envy you the task of putting that together. I was telling David, I was just like, I guess I really just decided to start on hard mode. Yeah. Because we don't usually do multi-camera. No. Um, <laughs> we don't usually do any fucked camera. Fucked up audio. <laughs> <laughs> just... uh, but I, I, I enjoy that sort of thing. And I had a lot of fun with it. So I'm glad people enjoy it. I was... <laughs> I... Because like I Comments said, I was, fully, I was fully working independently on it. <laughs> and I would just send like little segments of it. I'm like, is this is this too much? <laughs> Am I <laughs> going a little too silly with this? <laughs> but yeah, it was giving me like stress <laughs> to relive the microphone issues. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> You can to see remember. it. You can see it a little bit in the video because I cut around it for the most part. Um, but and also the monitor issues. That was I, it's like I said. I cut out the part where I'm just like on the verge of tears. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, I feel bad. <laughs> but, Turns out it um, was not you. Yeah, causing it the wasn't issue. me at all. But. Um, there's a part in the video where you can see Julia kind of like motioning for someone off the camera. It's because she was fixing my microphone or like communicating to someone to fix the microphone. So <laughs> it's wild. It's, yeah. it's it was a lot of fun though. All the shows yeah, were fun it was to so do. Fun, but it is stressful too. But it was like. We don't have a lot of footage of us doing a lot of like fun Seattle things because like we were just so tired. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I personally like only went to uh, the market like Pikes and um, didn't really do any other touristy shit because I just did not have the freaking energy. I would literally go back to the hotel after the shows and just lay there. <laughs> yeah, we watched a lot of catfish. <laughs> on the hotel tv yep that was a big a so big many part. times like saying we're gonna meet in the lobby at this time and then getting to the lobby only to see sorry we will be down as soon as this episode of catfish is over well i mean it was important yeah yeah, yeah. we had to bear Usually. witness to to neve's struggles <laughs> We did stab an abnormally uh, high amount of cakes for a little trip, I suppose. But yeah, I normally don't stab any cakes, and this yeah, time hard, hardly any cake stab. Normally, two, two <laughs> cakes—that's two hundred percent increase in <laughs> cake stab. I also was like, David, what should we do for the Patreon scroll? Maybe I'll do like a photo slideshow because we have a lot of cute photos and not a lot of video. But then I was too tired because I was just like so stressed out about like premiere issues. <laughs> so I was just like, uh, what video clip is kind of long? The one I, I, I timed how long a Patreon scroll would typically last. I took your video and was like, well, if I turn this to like 40% speed, <laughs> it's the exact length I want it to be. <laughs> So that's how you ended up with Jacob stabbing the cake as the Patreon scroll. Yeah, I thought that was a funny, funny touch. I did it as a joke, and then David and Nathan liked it. <laughs> Such is my life. <laughs> <laughs> Somebody asked about how Neve's name name is spelled. It's just N E V, mm -hmm. which you would think was like Nev, you but it's think. but it's Neve, and I don't I know if it's short for anything. Do we know that? That, well, don't look at me. Karina? Karina, do you know, know that? I don't know Neve. You don't, don't know Neve? I would assume it's short for something, but I couldn't tell you. Neve Shulman. I'm going to tell you. Oh, it's it's Yaniv or Yaniv. Y-A-N-I-V. Uh, Does anyone know how that's pronounced? 
Yaniv. Yaniv. It's probably what I would guess. Yeah. Yaniv. I do like the comment in chat. His full name's Yaniv. No last name. <laughs> 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 it's short for never catfish people <laughs> never never catfish people <laughs> <laughs> not talk about it never catfish people <laughs> these are the lessons i want you to take away from this stream I like this uh, this head neck angle you got going here. It's very yeah. sultry. What that neck do? Yeah, I was I was going off of uh, reference to official game art, and then decided to switch to just the the animation Spencer made instead. I do <laughs> love the art style of Hades, and it's really fun to do. <laughs> yeah, it's so nice. It's, it's so blocky. Fun. Big old black chunks. I like that heavy yeah. ink shading look. Spencer did say that he was uh, actively trying to honor the art style better in the new animation. And I think he did a wonderful job. I thought it was honored as hell. Yeah, it looks so good. I was honored to watch it. <laughs> <laughs> this is and a then fun, did, did anybody anybody in, in the chat watch the game awards last night? All of them? Because I, I did. Elden Ring won stuff. Elden Ring Elden got the game of the year. Ring. Which I think was good. Yeah. And they unveiled the new the new armored core. Right. The yes. armored core. It's a, a giant robot game mm. that um has not had a sequel in a very long time. Nice. But it's okay. like a cult classic. And the new one is now being made by the people who made Elden Ring. Ooh. So people are really hyped that we might get like a really good armored core and I, I played the original one on playstation one and i loved it back okay. then so I'm i saw people psyched. were i saw people were super hyped about it but i was not familiar with the older games it's like one where you got a robot and then you're always like switching out the parts to like make different builds and stuff Ooh. to go and do the missions that's cool. and you can give them legs or you can give them big tank feet <laughs> or you can give them booster ass <laughs> You can do whatever you want. Say you can give them big tits. You can give them big tits. You can give them big ass. Wow. Yeah. What more do you want? What more do you? Is are you not happy yet? <laughs> yeah. Final Fantasy fourteen won some awards. I was happy about oh, yeah. that too. Yeah. I was just watching via people reacting on Twitter. Uh, that was, I was probably not watching. right. I was playing Pokemon and being really frustrated that I'm I suck at raids and also I hate the raids in the new Pokemon. And then are I'd they, be like, Have are they, they very Hades? different from how They're they are? They're timed raids and they just like don't run well. Of course. And I've only been playing them solo, so it's not even an online thing. They're just like, they're really glitchy and like really weird. And it's like, it's very frustrating. <laughs> and um, I, I don't really fully get how they work. And I'm not leveled up enough to like do the high rank ones. So uh, terror rates are so busted online. I haven't even played them online. I can't even imagine. Um, But... Yeah, I, I just kept like logging on like in between me getting my ass kicked by a Staraptor <laughs> being like, have they announced Hades 2 yet? It doesn't look like they've announced Hades 2 yet. Back to the Staraptor. And then I'd fight the Staraptor again and lose. And then I'd be like, how about now? Okay, it was five minutes ago. Yay! <laughs> <laughs> like, the like, Staraptor. like. <laughs> and then back to the Staraptor. Yeah. 
I've just been playing Marvel Snap. I just got to Believe gold. Believe it or not. Oh my, yeah, I would have no idea. Not going to talk about it because nobody cares. Nobody freaking cares. Yeah, but I... it don't fucking... I'm not humoring this today. <laughs> I'm going to slap you. Did I get the Staraptor in the end? No. No, I didn't. Oh, so Karina is allowed to talk about Staraptor as much yeah, as she wants. Yeah, because everyone I can't understands talk about Marvel pokies. Snap. Marvel Snap, I'm sick of your shit. <laughs> I lost to the Staraptor too many times, but I did finally win my first five star, which was uh, the, the camel. Camerupt? Camerupt. Camerupt. I love like Camerupt. The evolved form of Nummo. Nummo is fun to say. Nummo. Yeah. So Nummo. Nummo. But yes, I did Nummo. finally win my first five star and I got no herb and I was so mad. <laughs> I don't know what that means. I'm sorry it's you didn't an, get your herb. Though. It's, a, it's to make sandwiches in the game. You need herbs to make sandwiches? Well, late game you can get herb and you can use herb to uh, up your shiny odds, which of course that's all I care about. <laughs> Shinies are the only end game. For Karina, yes. This is this is kind of him. This is definitely him. Yeah. Like a hundred percent. Yeah. I freaking know Dino Zagreus when I see him. Yeah, is he flirting with us, Nathan? Yeah. Oh, good. Absolutely. That's exciting news. I flirt back. Oh, okay. <laughs> Do I need to like roll or anything? What happens yeah. next? <laughs> yeah, roll. Uh, Hold on. Roll charisma. What's my charisma modifier? What do you think it is? Plus two. Okay, so roll plus two. Okay, hold on. Pulling mm -hmm. up a dice, a dice roller. Yeah. Okay, here we go. Okay, I got a, a 17 total. Uh, Yeah, he, he's into it. Oh, this is exciting. <laughs> okay, this is great. What does he say? Yeah, what does he say? Well, he's a dinosaur, so he, he kind of, he just kind of like growls at you. Okay. But like in like a, but like a sexy way. growl. Yeah, he does like the, you you know how in um in Jurassic Park when, when the raptors go like, um, um, um. <laughs> Is that Karina what he's knows. doing? Yeah. Ew. Karina loved that. It just reminded <laughs> me of the, the turtle having intercourse with the shoe. Oh, yeah. That's what it reminded me of. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's not like that. It's it's like the sound I made. I'm not going to do it again. But Yeah, please don't. Thank you. No one Milk? liked that. Dinosaur I'd like to kill? Why do you want to kill this dinosaur? Dinosaur I'd so like to rude. kiss. No. <laughs> I think I think the, I think it's a reference to Snilk. No, no. No. <laughs> no. No. Sorry. My bad. Um Yeah, this is him. He's good. This is, this is Dino Zagreus. He's good and you did good. You did good. You did good, Nathan. Good job. This, this little, yeah. this little thing that he does at the edge of his mouth. Yeah. Okay. Damn. He loves it. Cause I flirted successfully. Yeah. Now he's gonna eat you. Good. He's gonna. What I want. <laughs> Gross. Disgusting. Voras. <laughs> wow. It's kind of a, well, I'm not huh? gonna say it. We'll just talk talk of dinosaurs <laughs> and vor. Spoilers for oh! next week. No, I forgot about that. I'm excited. We got <laughs> we got two very fun guest episodes coming out next week. Which yeah. if if you're watching the vod of this, they've already come out. Whoa, <laughs> time! How well, did guess, you like them? Let like, us know. I guess if you're watching the vod of this, but you aren't a patron, 
because the VOD is available to patrons before it goes public. Yeah, but... they can watch it whenever they want. Okay, mm -hmm. so if you're watching the VOD of this and you're not a patron, it's the future. Then how did you like them? Then how did you like them? And if you are know. a patron watching the VOD before those episodes come out, how do you think you'll like them? Yeah. Ooh, chat. Place your bets. Who do you think the guests are? I'll I'll say there's one you'll never guess. <laughs> there's one. Can I can I say? I'll give a hint. There's one new guest and one returning guest. Mm. Yes, that's that's a good hint. But they're both excellent, <laughs> excellent episodes. I was reviewing them this past week, and they're both very fun. Uh, all right, it was I'm, Beyonce. I'm, You're right. It was Teddy Roosevelt. It was Teddy too. Teddy Roosevelt and Beyonce. <laughs> Yeah, a lot of people don't know that Teddy Roosevelt has been a, a guest before. He was going by a pseudonym <laughs> at the time. Yeah. I will say that um, the main reason I wanted to edit the... Who's drawing next? By the way. Um, I can... I'll go ahead and go. Please do. My, my big thing, I was just like, let me edit the Seattle video is just because I thought the Teddy Roosevelt was thing was so stupid and funny <laughs> it was really i was good. like i need to save that i have ideas for that for that only I and then i had to do the other like three hours of <laughs> yeah was it worth it yeah. it's all teddy roosevelt's fault i love the way you put teddy roosevelt's picture right over jacob so it yeah. looks like <laughs> jacob I... been replaced new trophy host because I watched all the footage and I was making a lot of notes about like what assets I'll need to get and like what bits to keep and what all the good bits were. And for that one, I did write, you know, get picture of Teddy Roosevelt facing this way. <laughs> <laughs> also, it was a fun throwback to because it's been a minute since I've given you notes on anything. Used used to be I was giving you notes on your on your articles yeah. asking you to make make the penis more realistic. Make the penis more realistic. <laughs> One of my first notes I ever gave Karina <laughs> at college humor. And uh, and you know, she did it. Look and, at us and now. She and did I it. did. I did. I was like, oh geez. Well, it's for money. <laughs> and I would make do the this. The penis for free. more realistic for money. <laughs> Draw Teddy Roosevelt on catfish. <laughs> oh man! <laughs> oh, that's a, a good. You had to do yes. I would never forget that. It was literally my first, my first job for y'all. Yeah. This is just a warm up. Yeah, I like, I like that you and Julia both do warm ups for. Uh, when you're getting suggestions and yours is always like a guy with a wide head shrugging and Julia's is always like an egg. a little a little egg having an existential crisis an egg existential crisis I love drawing a guy with a wide head you can't take that away from me I when I try to draw a guy with a wide head I make the head too wide but that's you make the, the head the danger of drawing just, a guy with a wide head just the right width it's the risk Draw your favorite snap card as an animal. Oh. My favorite snap card as an animal. I want to do that also for mine. Oh, then you should do it. I, I can do that too. You should both do it. We'll both do it. I bet we have different favorite snap cards. Probably. I think my favorite right now is Arrow. Arrow's so good. Let's bring in, I'm going to bring in the Arrow so we can look at it together while yeah. I yeah. There's so many, one of my favorite things about Snap, and it's, I'm not, I'm not gonna talk about gameplay, it's just I, I really like all of the different uh, artists that they that they got to work on it to do the different That's card cool. art variants. Me too, I, I was saying this to Julia um, yesterday because we were watching some gameplay of that new Marvel Midnight Suns game that's like an Ooh. XCOM game. And the, the graphics, like the art direction of that game is so ass that I was saying to Julia, like, it's so funny that like, I don't care about Marvel at all, but playing Marvel Snap has made me care about the characters because the art is so good. Right. That like, I see yeah, them and I'm like, it. I'm like, oh, I like them. I like this character because the art is good. And then <laughs> Midnight Suns made me hate them again. 
because the art is bad and they're like talking and won't shut up. I'm like, damn, you really, the art really makes a big difference. It really do. How it look, how it look matters so much. And I've, I still haven't gotten any, I know Max Greck did some, uh, Greca mm. did some, some of the art. Oh my, yeah, I've my got friend, the Max Greca carnage. Yeah. Like my, my friend, one of my other friends got one of his and I was like, Ooh, I know, I know that art style anywhere. So that's cool. Somebody outside is just honking their horn like beep 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 over and over again. Well, it's yeah. Lagoshi truck. <laughs> Let him in. I get it. You're Lagoshi truck. What do you what do you want? <laughs> he has anxiety. <laughs> They're doing it again. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> Did Arrow get nerfed? Is she only a six now? Uh no. I think this might be a pre, this is a pre arrow. Okay. From like the beta. Cause she's an eight. Yeah. Hold on. Hold on. <laughs> she's let an me... eight, but she's a six. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> hold on. I'm sorry. Let me just, let's just bring this in. Uh, I thought you were just going to draw one white line on the six. To I'm make sorry. Here we go. Here we go. Yeah. I don't want to give any misinformation. Yeah. I was about to be like, I don't think. I don't think Arrow would get played as much if she was only six power, but at eight power, mmm. Tasty. Real good. I'm just going to do like a, bird, Sorry. like a bird version. <laughs> oh, that makes sense. Yeah, because she's in the air. Because she's in the air. Like, what do you want from me? Yeah. She's in the air. I'm also like way out of practice for drawing because I was gone you're for on, a week. You were on a little trip. And I'm drawing on the wrong layer too, which doesn't help. <laughs> Just just merge them. Just merge them. Just when in doubt, them. just merge them. Just merge. Merge that burge. Merge the burge. I need to get back on the drawing game. Yeah, I want to start like like working at it again. Start getting better. I, I'm sick of my freaking trash that I draw. I edited a video for one week and I said I never want to stop drawing again. <laughs> <laughs> this sucks. <laughs> I miss drawing slurps. <laughs> I see. Here's my thing is I just don't like working. So like whatever I'm doing, I'm like, I wish I was doing the other thing. But then once I start <laughs> doing that, I'm like, oh, no, I just don't. I just don't <laughs> want to do bad too. No, that wasn't the problem <laughs> after <laughs> all. Yeah, no, I don't. I don't want to do renders. I don't want. <laughs> I don't want to edit videos. Oh no, Just... not renders. That's work too. I okay. Wanted to, I want to draw skate fan art. Okay. <laughs> I want to draw my Pokemon team. I need yeah. To that. I want to get far enough in Pokemon that I have a team that I can draw. I love my team. What's a bird? Who all's on like? your team? Yeah, it's got beak. Uh, yeah, it's got beaks. <laughs> this is funny They've to me. Got for a some woman yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so my team is uh all three starters oh wow so it's barnaby the the meow meow and then adam <laughs> the the gay duck right and then uh ford <laughs> f-150 the pink truck yeah is horrifying <laughs> <laughs> Jacob, they should get they should get you to do some yeah. some Marvel Snap uh, variants. I mean, or you I just draw know. them as as little fucked up animals. I don't know why they have it. Uh, and then I have who else do I have? I have Ruru, who's a lichen rock, the orange one, and uh, Multi. She is an Ampharos. And then I have Blank Room Soup, the mouse hold, who's kind of <laughs> goaded. <laughs> with the sauce or without? Um, with, with, with the, with the soup. With, with the goaded soup. with the soup. Goated with the soup. Yeah. <laughs> goated with the soup. <laughs> I remember, uh, Do I have of... any shinies? Ford F-150 is a shiny. Right, you got him he on your first. He's my miracle shiny. I got him on first egg. I think he is Matsuda method or Masuda method, so he's not full odds, but 
still very impressive. One egg. And I only hatched that egg to name him Ford F-150. So <laughs> Yeah, you weren't even so trying for a purple. shiny. Yeah. So now I'll never have that luck again. And I did find uh, full odds uh, shiny Venomoth. Ooh, what are the what are the secondary types on the final evos for the starters? I actually don't know. Uh, Meowscarada is dark. Mm-hmm. Clawful is fighting, and uh, Ford F one fifty is ghost. That makes sense. So it's that makes. It's interesting. <laughs> so it's, huh. huh. So that's, uh, hmm. Extremely. What am I doing here? He's You're drawing Arrow best. as a bird. Why am I doing this? Someone wanted it. Do they Someone... still want it, do you think? Or did they? I like it. I think it's good. I think you got the pose. This is like a fun pose practice, and then also you gave yeah. a funny bird face. I do love this horrible bird face. <laughs> it's really yeah. good. Our Barnaby and not Adam quite... from Bunny and Skate. Yes, yeah. Barnaby is Barnaby because my character's name is Tiger, and then Adam is Adam because just look at him. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, it's sirens now, huh? <laughs> Legoshi Ryu. truck is getting arrested. <laughs> Legoshi Ryu. truck Ryu. should get arrested. For indecency. For being too sexy. Shit. This is, this is obscene. I think it's good. I think it's good what you've done. You know why did you name the Croc Ford F one fifty? Because to me, the the it looks like a truck. The final Evo of the the Croc, big truck energy. So I thought I thought that was a fitting name. And Ford F one fifty was my first car. <laughs> yeah, also because it was Jacob's first <laughs> car. Yeah, and Karina wanted to honor that. Yeah. Very respectful. <laughs> Get some tail feathers. How about that? I was surprised once I realized what the crocodile's theming was because it didn't really click at any point, but he is still very truck shaped to me. Isn't his theming like hot pepper? Uh, it's Singer. What? <laughs> His signature move is that he it's a torch song. So his little flame turns into like a microphone. And I don't know, it, it doesn't have as clear theming as like the rest of them. Yeah. You know, like, you know, one's a magician, the other's a dancer. His is that he's a singer. But he is very truck shaped and you can kind of see it better, uh, once he's doing his signature move, but his like fire mane, it and he has like the fire nose, it kind of looks like a clown sort of motif of like in a way. I, I don't know. <laughs> Interesting. <laughs> Isn't it like how birds have uh, symbiotic relationships with crocodiles? I'm sure there's a lot of layers to his theming, whereas the others are too, they're just like, it's a magician, <laughs> it's a dancer. <laughs> What do you want? To, what do you want? <laughs> I'm done with this. I want Karina to draw now. Hey, this is really cute, Jacob. <laughs> I think it's more threatening than the original, so maybe it should be in the game. Yeah. Yeah. But as an eight, I mean a nine. As a nine, which is higher <laughs> so than the eight. One, the one variant that <laughs> yeah, is better get... than the original. <laughs> <laughs> get one more power if you, you use have to the look scary at this... bird. <laughs> to look at the bird, but. Um, I'm gonna go do a pee pee. Okay. Okay. That's so fine. I'll let you know how it goes when I get back. Thanks. He also has a weird sombrero. That's a bird's nest in the middle. That's a bird's nest. His fucking Evo line is all over the place visually, but I love Ford F-150. He's my miracle child. What should I draw? Nanami as a Sonic. 
<laughs> Maybe. I know Jacob's tired today, so I can do a long one too. Um, the new Hades girl riding Ford F one fifty. Oh, that's too long. <laughs> <laughs> um, we need Larry. Oh, I do love Larry. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, <laughs> Nanami mm -hmm. is a Pokemon trainer. Uh, have you met a character named Larry? <laughs> <laughs> I was telling my friend, I'm just like, I'm either going to like hate Larry for being overhyped or I'm going to be like lustfully <laughs> in love with him. And unfortunately, it's the latter. Yeah. Do you know Larry? No, I'm just agreeing with you. Hold on, I'm looking him up. Larry Pokemon. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah <laughs> yeah oh he that's is, great he is just he's just nanami i love a tired man who was the what was the tired man in the last one uh... there was a tired man in the last pokemon wasn't there he was like uh i cannot remember or maybe I... it was in the the sun and moon maybe oh, i'm thinking well, of i didn't sun play and sun and moon Pokemon tired man care. <laughs> Googling them. You want tired man? Not uh, re not main character. That show me the tired old man. No, no it won't I'm show me. I'm not on my. I'll draw Larry and Nanami. Chat, do you out. know who I'm talking about? <laughs> he was like a. Nanu. Nanu. Pokemon. Yes. I was looking yeah. for an excuse to draw Larry. Thank you, chat. It was Nanu. That's who I was thinking of. Or Nanu. I don't know how to pronounce it. Thank you, chat. <laughs> Uh, I do really love all the gym leaders in this game. They're cute. I love Larry. He's so... And I like the, the grass guy. The the scrungly uh, artist guy. Yeah. I'm back. <laughs> I'm drawing Larry. The cable guy? <laughs> no. No. <laughs> Larry, How dare you? Larry Butts from Phoenix, right? Oh, no. <laughs> from Pokemon. Uh, oh, I don't know him. He's so good. <laughs> what's he what's his deal? He's the normal gym leader and he's basically Nanami for Pokemon. Oh, I do like that. He's that got sounds thick, good. He got thick eyebrows and he looks done. He looks done with this. That sounds like a character I would design. He's he, the only one who seems a aware salary of man how janky and, the game he's um, in is. Yeah. <laughs> he's a salary man and like his signature move is a uh, facade. <laughs> of course. He's like when you're an adult you need to know how to do this. <laughs> <laughs> when you're like, poisoned as an adult you need to do extra damage. Yeah. <laughs> if you're suffering from a status condition. Yeah. <laughs> it just means you have to work that much harder. He's standing there looking at that five frames per second windmill with this expression on his face. <laughs> like, why do I live in this world? Can't even get a fully animated windmill. I remember <laughs> the first game that Facade was in, I think was... Uh, I think it was Ruby Sapphire. I could be... No, it was... Or was it... Uh, It might have been gold and silver, actually. Which is the one? Which is the one where your dad is the normal gym leader? A uh, ruby sapphire. That was ruby sapphire. But then, wasn't there a normal gym leader in gold and silver also? That's I think Whitney. gold and silver. Your didn't your dad also do something in gold and silver? We had a dad in gold and silver. Yeah, I don't remember. Dad. I thought I remember your dad being the a gym normal leader in, gold in gold and silver, and silver was uh, Whitney with the mill tank. Right. Yeah. Okay. I don't Damn, know Whitney with the mill tank. <laughs> uh -huh. 
Okay. Well, anyway, uh, the first time Golden I saw Silver, Koga is in it, and his daughter is a gym leader too. Right. Yeah, and Koga gets to be on the elite. <laughs> yeah, I'm like catching one. your brainwave. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, but anyway, the first time I saw the move facade, I thought it was pronounced fakeade. Yeah. <laughs> I did have to think just now <laughs> before I said it to be like how. I know it's not fakeade, but how is it going again? <laughs> That's what you ask for at the barber shop when you want to get a nice clean. Fake like, aid. give me the fakeade on the sides and back. <laughs> <laughs> it's a fake arcade. Yeah, exactly. Oh my god, I was talking with my brother and also my one of my friends because, like, growing up playing pokemon did you have the like magazine unofficial guides oh yeah did you use those actively my brother and i shared one for gold and silver and i swear to god that that magazine like permanently altered my brain chemistry yeah because we were just like we we would live by that guide yeah and i just remember because i have an ampharos in this game and i love ampharos so i was excited that it was back in the game um and it's a fairy it, like, type now, right? No, or, no. What is, is it? Or no? What is it? it dragon? It's, does it get? Does the? Does it get? That's some, mega. Mega, right? Okay, that's what yeah, I was thinking which of. Which isn't. In sorry, as as sorry, I, I got it wrong. Uh, sorry, I knew it got like, an extra type. Ampharos, yeah. Ampharos can learn a uh, thunder punch, and I remember in that fucking guide, it making this huge deal out of it learning thunder punch and so when it came up in this game i was like why would i have it learn thunder punch it's not an attacker it's a special attacker but for days i was thinking about that stupid gold and silver guide being like um <laughs> <laughs> uh it's so awesome that it gets to learn thunder punch thunder this punch. is so good sickest shit ever well, because and i was in... i was literally thinking about it for days and i talked to my friend about it and they were like because in gen 2 in gen it was 2. by types yep. not by move uh, things and i'm just yep. like we'll never be normal yeah <laughs> like there's there are wrinkles in our brain just permanently occupied by like this fucking pokemon knowledge that we've like fed it from childhood that it's why... can never be used for anything else that's why hitmonchan was such trash in uh in the original pokemon game because it learned all the different elemental punches but all of the punches were special attacks and it had ah. no special attack. So <laughs> I like that you life. had that ready. It could just weakly, <laughs> just weakly punch you with fire, but it's like, um, this is actually special. It <laughs> this, has nothing to punch. do with how strong I am. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> but Sorry conversely, you, with my you could teach, I, I think, maybe Gengar could learn one of the punch some someone one of the special guys could learn like one of the <laughs> elemental punches i think and they're all was... special guys Nathan. yeah <laughs> but yeah i'm just like ugh. <laughs> what is it like to not be like yeah. lifetime pokemon pilled <laughs> <laughs> i'll never alakazam alakazam was the one that could learn the punches uh... yes yes of course see i've got a my controversial probably not that controversial ampharos it. opinion mm -hmm. is that i really wanted it to stay a sheep and I was sad when it wasn't a sheep anymore. It became like a giraffe yeah. instead. Or I whatever. wanted it to be like a big lightning sheep. And it's, it's not. a long That's sheep. Fair. Yeah. Yeah. They could, they should do one of the, uh, an alt evolution for it where it's just a, a big sheep. Yeah. I want to have like a, hu a huge fluff. Yeah. It'd become take like forever full, on this drawing since full cloud. Is tired anyway. Just by the way. Yeah. Please. As I start, as I start horizontal flipping. That's when you know it's serious. <laughs> Yeah, because if I'm going to draw Larry Anonymy, if it comes out nice, I want to post it. I have not been posting art. <laughs> post, post, post. Post, post. Post. Fix it and post. Post. Fix it and post. Fix it and, po and post. Anyway, carry on with your hot takes. I don't, that was it. 
I love the new giraffe rig evolution. Do you mean? I think it's so what, cute. What's it called? It's like. I don't remember. Garip, good. That's that's the first one I'm trying to breed for shiny. It's like giraffe, backwards, right? Giraffe a big. Giraffe a oh, big. It's for for giraffe. For giraffe. Yeah. It's so cute. I love it. Yeah, it's cool. It it reminds me of those like kind of vintagey giraffe toys. I don't know what they're called, but if you know, you know. If you know, you know. And if you don't know, you don't know, like me. And if you don't know, now you know. I think if you took like a, like a hit rate, like if you had like a batting average for knowing when someone says, if you know, you know, mine is like pathetically low. I barely yeah. ever know if someone says, if you know, you know. I feel like mine's would be low, but I'm always the one saying, if you know, you know. Yeah, you say, I think <laughs> yeah, you're the reason my batting average <laughs> yeah, is so low. I'm driving down your average because <laughs> yeah. I'm always saying, like, <laughs> referencing the most deranged shit. And you're like, am I supposed to know? <laughs> yeah, I don't know that one. It makes me feel like I should know. I genuinely don't know what they're called, but, you know, they're kind of like vintage toys. Um, I'm... It, I think it gives it gives me comfort knowing yeah, that comforting... Karina knows. Oh, I thought you were going to say the giraffe thing. Oh, I don't I don't know. Okay. I I hardly ever know, but it doesn't bother me because I'm like, well, at least Karina knows. So <laughs> someone knows. So we I don't have that base just covered. Has, like, like yeah, this kind of shape. You know, like. Like just just this overall shape is just really cute, cute to me. Looking like yeah. a damn <laughs> precious moment. Yeah. It looks like I don't a, know. Maybe they're like not giraffes, but there's, there's like deers, deers who kind of have that shape. Oh yeah, it's a bambus. God, I don't fucking know what anything looks like. I'm gonna go back to drawing Larry. <laughs> You're drawing Larry. <laughs> he's he's already looking really good. Do you think there's any world, not any world, any situation any world? <laughs> in which you could say, if you know, you don't know and have it, have that be true? Um, I guess if you're describing something that's like worse than you think you, than you think it is. If you think, you know, you don't know. I mean, <laughs> right. Yeah. <laughs> or if it, yeah, it's like the two no's refer to different. Like if you you know some sort of disinformation, then it means you, you don't actually know. yeah right. So it's like if you know if if you're like the world the know, world is flat. <laughs> if you know yeah, you don't you, know yeah if you know the world is flat you don't you then don't you know. don't know. <laughs> I miss Julia. <laughs> <laughs> you don't think we'd be having this conversation if Julia were here? Well, we'd be Julia would three have derailed layers it. deeper into this <laughs> or derailed from it <laughs> if Julia was here. Julia would have thought of something that none of us would have known about. Yeah, and, we and then we wouldn't know. <laughs> and then we... <laughs> I never know with Julia. One of us has to know at all times. If ever one of us doesn't know and none that's of us danger. know, I think that's when we just have to like end the channel. Can I... Yeah. Can I talk about this bit Julia's been doing with me? <laughs> yeah, you, you definitely should. I feel I feel bad that she's not here to like bask in, in this. Yeah, we but... can talk about it again yeah. another time. Yeah. But she, she's so, not done with it. <laughs> so on the the recently uploaded stream, the uh, the Game of Life stream, I guess it very was very good stream. It was a great stream, very fun. Uh, I guess you you had been playing a game on Secret Sleepover. Yeah, it's the the case of uh, the Golden Idol is the game. Okay, and there's a there's an image in that game of just a a horrible little guy pooping. He's like a no like a naked gnome. A naked gnome just making this like deranged face, and he's sitting on a pot and like pooping in it and he yeah he doesn't have pants on and he's got like a hot dog nose yeah <laughs> uh and so julia just i guess on that stream is when it started she just started sending me that image 
And so she's been sending me that image ever since. <laughs> At no sort of regular cadence, it, it's, she manages to surprise me with it because she sends it to me on Discord and in text message form. Mm -hmm. But then y'all went on your trip and like after you left, I get a text from Julia that says, did you get my email? And so I go and I check my email and there it, I have an email from her with a subject line <laughs> work thing. And so I just assumed, because Julia never really fully takes a vacation. So I just assumed it was like something work related. And so I was like, oh, dang. Okay. Yeah. Let me open this. God damn it. And it was, it was that image. <laughs> and then, and then yesterday I got this very official looking uh, letter in the mail that had like the, like the one, the one sheet. I, I wonder if I still have it. Hold on, I'm gonna see if I can find it. God. While he's looking, I'll I'll just express to everyone the the pure joy that it brings Julia yeah. to send Nathan the gnome. Did he take off his headphones? Yeah, he did. Uh, he doesn't know. <laughs> <laughs> How many? <laughs> okay, I don't I don't have the cover page. The cover I have, page. I don't have the official look. Well, yeah, it was like a full like not not like regular envelope, but like a full piece of paper size envelope. And it was like US USPS priority mail from y'all's address to mine and then inside there was like a full page that was just like our addresses cover page like very <laughs> official looking so i was like i assumed it was like some tax documents or something because again julia's been like working on that this whole time and i was like oh i didn't know that i was going to get something and so it like it fully got me i like <laughs> removed that page it, and then <laughs> there, there's the gnome and then there and then just this and so <laughs> yeah I, I don't know how she's gonna escalate from here but I'm very excited oh, I love this bit it's a great bit <laughs> it's really good and she just like when she thinks of a way that she wants to send you the gnome <laughs> She just walks around our apartment just cackling. I'm, Think, thinking I'm glad. about you getting the gnome. <laughs> it, and she'll just like bust out laughing out of nowhere and then be like, I just thought of another way to send Nathan the gnome. <laughs> I she deserves I love she deserves this. all the happiness in the world. So I'm I'm glad I'm glad this is what <laughs> And then you get the gnome, and so that's and then, a win. And then I get the gnome. Um, yeah, it's really good. It's, it's been it's been really fun. The reason she mailed that to you is because she was telling to my parents the entire saga of the gnome. <laughs> and then she was like, "Oh, what if there was a way I could have something mailed to him while I'm here? That would really throw him off the trail." And so she like went online and found a service. <laughs> service. Because the because the return address was yeah. your address in Brooklyn, not wherever you were in Georgia. Yeah, yeah. That's so good. So it's a little confusing to yeah. make you think something's going on. Well, she got me. She I fully was not expecting the gnome. And I'm here's the thing. I'm gonna let my guard down. I have very short. My all my memory slots are, are taken up Pokemon with Pokemon information. Pokemon information as we've established. <laughs> Marvel Snap information and like Aww. quotes quotes from shows and videos that I found funny. Yeah. Um so I'm gonna forget to be on guard for the gnome. And I'm gonna get gnomed. For the rest of your life. For the rest of my life. And I you know, you know, <laughs> you know, <laughs> you know, yeah, she she spent like $30 to mail that to you. Why? 
she wanted to have it shipped like express. <laughs> yeah. It was it very was important very, to her it that was it arrived. The most <laughs> official looking letter I've ever gotten. <laughs> I was so sure it was something company related. It was it was really funny. It was really good. <laughs> so I'm, I'm excited uh, to continue the the saga for yeah. for all of you viewers. We'll update you as it progresses. <laughs> Deep Blue Ink already said he was going to animate this. <laughs> oh, good. I'm very glad. So it's you know that this is the the beautiful cycle of content. Yeah. Yeah. Like we we do things that then generate other things that we do that then make us talk about what we did and then Deep Blue Ink animates what we talked about. Yeah. And then we talk about Deep Blue Ink's animation. Mm-hmm. Wow. And then and someone <laughs> posts a clip of us talking about it and then someone... And then Deep Blue Ink animates us talking about... Yeah, talk, yeah animates us talking about him. And then we talk about that. This wow. is this is how you people are always like, you know, how do you come up with so many ideas for stuff to make and you you never run out of content? It's impossible to run out. Yeah. Yeah, it's a Life it's an is endless cycle. Sweaty. It keeps <laughs> self-generating. We can't stop it if we wanted to. Yeah. <laughs> Infinite it's... content glitch. <laughs> is this a <laughs> Is this a Staraptor? Yeah. Spoilers your your nemesis. Baby. It's just that one Staraptor. What, <laughs> what was its type? It was steel. Dean Blue Ink said, I'm going to animate this too. Oh, great. Are we still going to be in a cage? <laughs> reading <laughs> reading <laughs> off a prompt? That was really good. <laughs> yeah. Jacob was like, dead-eyed defiant looking at him just like going through the motions reading it and i was like genuinely scared <laughs> i love the i love the subtle the subtle facial differences you put changing the context of the yeah. audio clip karina reading the uh maryland to normal <laughs> Yeah. handbook and then gasping what really cracks me up is that my roommate does not watch Drawfy. he is very much like mm -mm. <laughs> I already know you it's weird <laughs> um, but I love that you refer I think to him that... as your roommate still even though <laughs> but um, uh You'll forever be your roommate. Yeah, that's how it works. That's beautiful. But, uh, he does like get recommended Deep Blue Ink on YouTube, so he knows the bits that have been animated. That's great. Yeah, because uh, he he doesn't watch our stuff, but he did reference Orbeez the other day. <laughs> <laughs> you giving the press conference. <laughs> <laughs> what if we um ate Orbeez <laughs> as, as a society? society. <laughs> <laughs> it's good. Yeah, I mean, I like those two. They're like nice and short and punchy. I can like show them to people. Like, you know, this is kind of it. It makes me seem funnier. Yeah, and yeah. I can just show and be like, this was a this was a pretty funny bit we did. Imagine this, but less visually interesting, and it takes longer to be as funny. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And that's is, is that what you want? Moment. That's my job. And the moments look like this. Yeah, we're out here. We're like in the mines. Yeah, cute. Yeah. When we sit here and we talk for two hours straight, we're in the mines, trying to find the diamonds. Yeah. Yeah. And then we you... find a few diamonds, and Deep Blue Ink <laughs> scurries in. <laughs> Like a little rat <laughs> scoops up the diamonds and then shows them diamond, to everyone. It's like, look at all these diamonds rat. I have. Look at these diamonds I made. It's all diamonds over here. <laughs> but here we are. We're getting black lung. <laughs> and here in the mines. <laughs> Bro, what the fuck? 
fuck. <laughs> oh, is like the bird this. nuzzling him? Yeah, it's yeah. just doing a little. Oh, that's cute. It's yeah. doing what uh what Joy did to you. Yeah, I love them. Pokemon are cute. I feel like they should lean more into that in the games. Yeah, the either Pokemon make them being cute, cute or make them sexy. Yeah, just like having I do, doing more they, cute things. Yeah, it, there is a cute thing in this one. When you picnic, you can uh, wash them. Like you, you can do the washing thing mm -hmm. to Aww. like heal them, and it is cute. <laughs> but they should have them do more cute things. Yeah, I really like when you do it with uh, Florigato or Florigato, whatever its name is, the middle meow meow, because you like the wash him and then he goes. Oh. And then he goes, hmm. <laughs> <laughs> and it's so cute. <laughs> Hell yeah. Oh, goodbye. Huh? This there is just the way you moved the canvas. It looked like you were just sending him away. I do forget that I, since I skipped last speed draw, I haven't been criticized about how I move my canvas in a it, hot second. It wasn't a criticism. It was <laughs> no. <I> was, <laughs> Nothing I makes me more acutely great. aware of something than when I do it on Drawfi and get a bunch of people being like, "Whoa, why do you do it like that?" I'm like, uh, <laughs> "Why do you say water like that?" <laughs> why do you flip your canvas so much? So you can make the good arts, good yeah, arts, so that it looks good arts. both ways. You're I don't know welcome. What happened to my voice there. Garts. Garards. Garards. If you're not flipping your canvas, you're missing out on a potential to make your art better. You hear that, viewers? Flip it. Flip it. Face what your fears. Real good. Face dun, your flaws. Because <laughs> I know you don't have those eyes lined up correctly. <laughs> mm -mm. Unless you flip it, you're not going to know either. Your brain's tricking you. Your brain's it fooling it looks, you. It looks normal, but then you flip it, you go, uh oh. It's, ba it's, it's wrong it's and bad. Let's try. Okay, I'm just eating up as much time as possible. Because yeah, go I for it. I think they're cute. And I already, Jacob is tired. I already have my next prompt ready to go. Oh, yeah. I gotta make sure you have time to do that. It's actually... Well, I have to pick my second favorite snap card to draw as an animal because my first favorite snap card is already an animal. Which one's your favorite? Yeah, Cosmo. Talk about it. Cosmo's the dog, the astronaut Cosmo's dog. The astronaut oh. dog. It's just a dog wearing an astronaut suit. It's so cute. Aww. Cosmo is really I... cute and also makes people very mad. Yeah. Yeah, I was about to ask, what's the gameplay element? Oh my god. Uh, <laughs> so they just fell off what? their chair again. Again? Joy, get it together. So there are a lot of like unique. <laughs> Joy. Stupid, dude. I diagnose your cat with stupid. This is like the 50th time this has happened. It happens to her all the time. She gets too asleep and just falls off. This didn't used to happen, did it? No, I think she's dumber. <laughs> I think she's dumber than she used That's to be. It's, it's like that thing There's where the there's that thing that they say that if you own cats, they like alter your brain chemistry to make you stupider and obsessed with your cats. Yeah. But I think you've altered your cat's brain chemistry to also make your cat stupider. We're all just getting dumber over here progressively yeah. <laughs> over time. <laughs> they weren't um, ready. Anyway, the the dog in the game, so, you so play there are, the dog. There are, there are abilities that cards have, and some of them are just like unique abilities that like, can't really be interacted with, but the most common types of abilities are either on reveal or uh, ongoing. So like on reveal abilities happen as soon as the card gets revealed and ongoing abilities are abilities that 
continue as long as that card is in play. And Cosmo uh, has an ongoing ability that uh, no on reveal abilities can activate at the location you've you've played him at. If you sneak him in at a bad time, the opponent will like play the card that's like the linchpin to their success. And then the ability just doesn't trigger and then they just leave. Yeah, the game. like there's there's uh, this they just card. angrily leave the game. Yeah, uh, you you can force you can force a lot of retreats just by playing Cosmo. And like it's funny because it's a space dog. It's just a dog. <laughs> it's, it's just, just a, a cute silly guy. It's just a cute little dog. Um, it's like guy. I've showed you a space dog and you leave in and fury. That was, that was me playing Ojamas. <laughs> it's in, the dog like, that makes people U mad. P V P. Oh yeah, I'm sure Ojamas piss people off. I mean, it's not even that they're like good. It's just that if you play dual links, like speed speed mode, uh, where you have character abilities, uh, Manjome or Chaz's character ability is that he automatically starts with Ojama Country on the field. So it's in play. And what that card does is that as long as you have an Ojama card, like a monster on the field, with Ojama Country, it'll switch everyone's attack and defense. Right. Because Ojama oh, is yeah. a zero attack deck, but like all their defense. So I would roll into like the bottom rank of PvP and play it <laughs> against people who only played like attack like beat em up decks. Yep. <laughs> and just they completely... wouldn't realize that I've Ojama Country them. And I'd just be sitting there like, as they attack yeah, with their yeah, yeah. zero attack uh <laughs> fucking machine guy and welcome I'm to with, ojama country with my silly guy <laughs> i love the implication that like ojamas are like pacifists unless they're in ojama country in which case <laughs> yeah, then it's, so... <laughs> it's on site <laughs> and then also anyone else who's in Ojama country is like so baffled by it that they forget how to fight. Yeah, they're like, yeah. what do I what do I do? <laughs> I, I don't, don't know. What, yeah. They're so I've weird. Never, These... I've never played full Ojama because that archetype gets weird. <laughs> but um, I do love just rolling in with Ojama country like, hey, guys. <laughs> That's fun. I love this. I love stupid decks like that. Yeah, yeah. I like I only play stupid decks in Yu-Gi-Oh. That's my problem. <laughs> it's just I only play fun. character decks that I like. Like I like the character, so I'll, I'll learn their fucking deck. But if it's not a stupid gimmick deck, it's like not my favorite. <laughs> Yeah, I've been thinking about once I have more cards, making like some theme decks and Marvel Snap that are going nice. to be bad, but but fun, but fun. Yeah, yeah that's I like matters. I like the theming around some of the cards, like how all of the Guardians of the Galaxy have the same on reveal effect, just at different power levels and yeah. uh, energy costs. I think that's cute. They're just like predict what your opponent's going to do. Cards, yeah. they all just. They all just get, they just get stronger if your opponent played a card at the same place that you played them. Karina, I like to see them together, these two. Yeah. It I'm seems right. I haven't seen more of them together. Just, You're making it happen. <laughs> I just, I don't, I don't know if it's just because I'm like deep in fucking Nanami brain the past few months, but I'm like when I met Larry, I was just like, it's just the same guy. They have the same temperament. Yeah. <laughs> they're just they're, going to work. Yeah, they're just dudes who have to work. <laughs> Because that's literally like his thing. He's just like, yeah, I'm a salary man, but they also like make me be the gym leader of this town. So let's get this over with. I'm hungry and my boss will dock my pay if I talk too long. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm just like, hello. <laughs> Sir. That's very good. He's very cute. I hate how instantly clocked i was <laughs> they knew like, you were oh, gonna no. play they were like we're yeah. gonna get karina's ass with this one they got a lot of people's <laughs> asses with this one i don't know where the fucking hand goes whatever i don't fucking care 
What's is, he doing with his Is he going to have a pogey? His fucking watch. No. Oh, it. <laughs> he doesn't have time for that. <laughs> what kind of Pokemon would Nanami have, though? What's like the most business like Pokemon? Uh, Who's like really stern? Gum shoes. That would be pretty good. Kind of has the same hair. Oh. Or um, sock and throw. Mr. Which, Mime in a suit. Which Pokemon <laughs> has a knife? Mime in a suit. <laughs> that new Pokemon that's just like a girl with a big hammer. <laughs> that is not Nanami. No. Scraggy. Haunch Crow. These are all good. Oh, Haunch Crow. Haunch Crow is pretty good. That kind of fits. Yeah. yeah, Mr. Mr. Rhyme is Mr. Mime in a suit. That's true. I should be trying to draw a hand today. It's not gonna happen. <laughs> what's the what's the held item that increases your, your crit chance? Uh spec something is it glasses chat will know i can't stop yawning oh absol is nice too i just yeah. like absol. scope lens yeah because that's like his ability which is just he he knows how to land critical hits uh, oh yeah yeah I guess like a, a high crit Pokemon could be good too for him. Who's got big crits? <laughs> God, I'm so out of, I'm so out of practice. I used to just play. My Marvel Snap before Marvel Snap was just doing, ran battles on, uh, on Smogon. Uh -huh. I'm sure the meta is all fucked up now that they Miascarada got the new game out. always crits. Yeah, Miascarada's uh, special move always crits. Well, that maybe that's cool. a good one then. Yeah. Well, we're getting Absol. Yeah, I already drew Absol. That's also a good one. Yeah. He's raising a Miascarada. He can have more than one Pokemon. Yeah, they all usually do. Just giving him that dirty look for no reason absol is all i love absol's design i always did since it first was released but it does look like the type of pokemon that would hate you yeah, <laughs> yeah. i mean that's that's why you put it in your party if you want yeah. one pokemon that never <laughs> again that's that's exactly the same mood he's just showing up to work <laughs> he's like this you is my job this absol. yeah yeah the absol comes in every every morning and he makes a salary. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. A Pokemon with a salary. <laughs> this is a wild Absol that just comes <laughs> yeah, in. Yeah, I just... <laughs> <laughs> Nanami does not own one. this Pokemon. <laughs> Every time. Nanami, do you have gloves? No. What do your things look like? I'm not even going to bother with that. <laughs> <laughs> just slide that back down yeah you get back down there don't You're worry about for that the subway they don't know each other they're strangers <laughs> they're going to different places yeah actually i'm not even gonna bother with drawing a background there i did it there they are yeah the most normal men yeah, there they are, <laughs> surrounded by chaos. <laughs> we love them. They're so normal. Um, Is it me? Do... Or are you doing more? I'm doing some shading? Gonna... Oh, hell no. Okay. Just like weird. Oh, just a little blur. Yeah, a little sort of cinematic some depth. blur. A little depth of field. Yeah, that's cool. That's Yay. cool shit. Okay. I need to draw more pogies. Do it. I love all the new gym leaders. Okay. Okay. Enough. I've had enough. He's me. 
He's Nathan's back, back. Remember this guy? Yeah. Oh, <laughs> there he is. Participants can now see my screen. I know that's what I would assume <laughs> that's would happen. The point. After. <laughs> that's why <laughs> we're doing this. Screen. Thank you, Zoom. Good update. Uh, so here's Cosmo. That's what he looks like. Aww. He's a space dog. He's a space dog. <laughs> um, with like crazy eyes. And yeah. He's just a little. Someone, someone was asking, does Cosmo also prevent your own on reveals from happening? And he does. And so I have him in this deck with the card that I'm going to draw. The Destroyer, who is a very overstatted card. <laughs> he, he big. He's a big. He's a big guy. He's overstatted, but his on reveal effect is he destroys all your other cards. But if you play him on the same location as Cosmo, they actually nerfed him. He's a 15 power, not a 16 power anymore. But um, you know. Still 18 power on one location can oftentimes win. Plus, your opponent is likely not going to be playing cards there because they want to avoid the Cosmo. So <laughs> I'm gonna draw I'm gonna draw this as an animal. Which one? I'm thinking maybe a a rhino. Wow. But what a but rhino's already a rhino. <laughs> but me. Oh, you're right. What should I draw him as then? He could Wait, be animal. like a Rhino is already a rhino. Armadillo is pretty good. Armor bear. Oh, armor bear. Yeah, make a bear. That was Love Six idea. I'm not going to steal idea. that without proper <laughs> attribution. It's a good, wow. It's a good idea, Love Sick. Armor bear. Armor bear. Armor bear. Armor bear. Armor bear. Armor bear. He already does have a bear-like appearance. Yeah. <laughs> Just sort of make it more bear. More bear-ess. More, <laughs> more bear-ess. Trying to do a Morbius. Yeah, I, I get. I see. I understand. Something we could workshop, I guess. I think, yeah. More bear-ess. Yeah, it didn't really come out as good as I hoped. <laughs> but I'm already a little... <laughs> Embarrassed, and then I get more embarrassed. More embarrassed. <laughs> Joanna Ortiz said, "I crocheted a saddle for Jacob Horse, and it makes me laugh every time I look at it." Was that the one? Did oh, you tweet that? Because I think I you? saw that today. Yeah. And it was so funny. Julia sent it in the group chat. Yeah, it was sent in the group chat. Congrats! You're in the group chat. You're you're living in our group chat, rent free. Or at least the horses. <laughs> Have you tried to ride it? Yeah. You could put a tiny cowboy on it. Ooh. Crochet a tiny cowboy and put him in the saddle. Yeah. Well, I bet Raymond could fit on it. Put Raymond on it. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't just say that on prompt. Did I have Raymond right behind my computer? Raymond. Such a little guy. He's too small. He's the perfect size. For all the crimes he's committed. I got you in Seattle. You were my souvenir. <laughs> you were at the shows. Yeah, Raymond was at the front row seat. <laughs> Yeah, we tied Raymond to a chair. It's like Raymond right next to David. <laughs> yeah. In the front row. And what was the day when we actually started uh, uh, doing uh, meet and greet sitting? That was that was Saturday, Saturday right? After yeah. yeah, we we only did one day of standing meet and greet. We that learned. Was all we, could, we learned. <laughs> It was a process. It was a whole learning yeah. process. Because he, he cameoed in that as well. I do want to do some more live shows. Yeah. 
it's just it's just nice it's yeah. just nice to have people tell you that they like you and the stuff that you spend all your time doing yeah most people don't get that treatment most people just have to do whatever they spend all their time doing and no one ever tells them that they like it yeah so we're so very fortunate you. in that regard Oh, I meant to tell y'all too. We got recognized twice in Georgia. Nice. Shit. And one time the the it finally happened. I was out at we were out at dinner with two of my friends and um the waiter came up to the table and he was like, "Okay, so this is weird and I've never done this before, but that other table wants to to buy y'all a round of drinks." Oh. And we were like, oh. Okay, we like we didn't know why. And we're like, I mean, that's nice. I don't know. I don't know why, but we'll take it. <laughs> and then at the end of the the dinner, um, the two people from the table came up and they were like, "Hey, Jacob and Julia, we're just really big fans. Aww, Hope you're having a good nice. time in Georgia." It was very sweet, and we got to look very cool in front of our friends. Damn! Whenever I get recognized in front of my friends, they just laugh at me <laughs> <laughs> and make fun of me. But secretly, they think it's cool. I bet. Yeah, that's them. That's them coping. Yeah. <laughs> They're like, "Dang, Karina's so cool. I have to take her down a peg." Yeah, or else she's gonna get too confident. Yeah. You're already so powerful. I do like to imagine because Jacob's the only one of y'all that's like actually met a bunch of my friends. Uh, so Jacob's the only one who saw how aggro the vibe is. <laughs> the vibe is truly in shambles. I mean, I can, I can just sort of imagine based on you can extrapolate from Karina's yeah. personality. Pe people, I'm people just like, there's would, a reason. There's who a would reason. Remain friends. <laughs> I mean, you can tell from Spencer, but when Jacob came to the cabin last year, we were all in just like a state peak, peak state. Yeah, it was. It truly was a state. And I'm just like, you get it now, right? You get it. It all made sense. It all came together. It all clicked suddenly. Yeah. But the, the second time we got recognized, we went to, and I mean, this is going to be like, of course you got recognized here. We went to a, a retro video game store. Oh, yeah. I saw that person on Twitter. Yeah. Right. And it was the person working the, the counter there when Julia was checking out was like, are you Julia Drawfee? Aww. And Julia was like, yeah. <laughs> and they were like, okay, I'm kind of freaking out right now. Aww, and then just continued sweet. checking Julia out. <laughs> How sweet. Yeah, it was very sweet. They were they were both super nice. People are always super nice, which I'm very grateful for. Yeah. Because otherwise I would hide. absolutely piss my pants. Yeah, hide my face. I do like that it's like most of the time I feel we get recognized. It's in just like, of course, <laughs> of course there. <laughs> Yeah. yeah, I've Kino been recognized Kinea. so many times at Kino Kinea. It's the most recognized. Um, I got recognized at Daiso. And that one was also just very funny to me because I was buying supplies for Anime NYC. And... Uh, but whenever I go to Daiso, I just go a little silly mode. So they had... Um, you know, the little section with like their Barbie dolls, like the Daiso Barbie doll. And um, they had these little capelets that look like birds for your dolls. And I was just like, ooh, I could use it on my anime figurines for my Glorbos. So I'm just <laughs> I'm just like feverishly grabbing this stupid bird capelet for a toy. And someone comes up to me and is like, uh, this is weird, but I'll be like, I'll feel crazy if i don't ask are you karina and i'm just standing there like <laughs> yeah <laughs> but they were super nice too <laughs> that always makes it okay yeah but it's also... also a bit oh. of a joke because my friend works in the same building as the daiso and i he catches me there all the time and he's always just like karina from giraffe and i'm huh. like shut up <laughs> 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 
I went there the other day and he threatened to take his lunch break to come see me. And I was like, no! <laughs> Don't see me. <laughs> I'll cry. <laughs> Sorry, Nathan. Were you saying something? Oh, no, I was. Well, I was interrupting you, and then I and then I stopped that myself. Is so true, bestie. What were you um, saying, though? Uh, oh, I just. <laughs> I also like it when um, people people will tweet that they like thought they saw me somewhere that I like. There's no way I could have been there. Oh yeah. They'll be like, I was. I was in this place, and I saw Nathan, and I'm like, you saw any white man with a beard yeah. like no you didn't <laughs> you just saw a white guy i was so it sure it was all Nathan. Us. yeah i mean i'm sorry i'm sorry you have to deal with that i did get someone tweeting at me one time like in 2019 i think where they were or, or 2020 where they were just like i just saw karina Jaraffi in the la airport and i'm like no, you didn't. <laughs> I haven't been to LA since 2018. <laughs> Who did you yeah. see? Because they were like, she was even wearing a drawy shirt, but I didn't think to go up and say something. I'm like, who did you see? <laughs> <laughs> who did you see in the LA airport? <laughs> a Karina lookalike drawy fan. Yeah. I wonder if they've gotten stopped multiple times wearing drawy merch and looking like Karina. <laughs> Um, maybe you just saw another racially ambiguous person with glasses and this hairstyle. Yeah. <laughs> I get I that mean, a that's, lot. <laughs> that's Karina for you. Yep. <laughs> People never say they think they saw me somewhere that they didn't, but they do always say that they've seen my doppelganger somewhere. And I'm yeah, like, you're a white male preset. Like I'm like the most basic version <laughs> of a white dude. So there, yeah, you probably did. There's a lot of us out there. <laughs> we're, we're numerous. Yeah, for better or worse. Yeah, you either saw the shaved version or the unshaved version. <laughs> this is cute. Yeah, I like the shapes you you did on this. I like this so much better than the real thing. They should do them all as animals. They should do yeah. them all as animals, except that Cosmo is just a human. Yeah, Cosmo is a human <laughs> astronaut. Cosmo is just a guy. I still don't have Destroyer, so. Yeah, Destroyer basically. Uh, I don't have Destroyer. No. Pathetic. I know. Yeah. The nice thing about Destroyer is to make the deck for him it's basically all pool one and two cards except for destroyer and so i pulled destroyer pretty early into pool three and was just like well i guess i'm playing a destroyer deck <laughs> i'm gonna ride this high yeah all the way to the end game yeah you need so many other cards to play like most of the good pool three decks but the destroyer deck is like He's enough to carry it. They had to nerf him, and he's still pretty good. Because there's so many cards that, like... I mean, there's Cosmo, but then there's also cards like uh, Professor X and Armor that just, like, protect your cards from getting destroyed as well. So there are a lot of board states where you can just play Destroyer without really having any of the drawbacks. And he's just a big boy. Damn, Nathan, why don't you kiss him then? <laughs> Maybe. He's doing it. He oh. kissed Destroyer. What's your least favorite card? Enchantress. Oh, I love Enchantress. She ruins my deck. She she does the same <laughs> the same thing as Cosmo, but two For ongoing two ongoing cards instead of on uh, reveal cards. All my all my cards are ongoing. She she just turns them off. It's really funny. Yeah. More like off but, going. But her effect isn't on reveal. So sometimes I'll play Cosmo defensively to if I like have a bunch of my cards on one location and I'm like feeling like they're going to play Enchantress, maybe I'll play Cosmo there. And then it's like, oh, my Cosmo counters your Enchantress. I think I just like her because I have two really good vari uh, variants. Though the variants of Enchantress are awesome. Yeah, I've got the cool like swampy one. 
where it looks like she's like a elf or some shit. <laughs> and then I got, I just got the one where she's like sitting with like her feet up on the Hulk, like, uh, like nice. Karina resting her feet on Kaiba. <laughs> <laughs> She has the same energy. She's like on a throne. At first, oh, yeah. I was I was gonna say that was weird, but then you turned into a compliment towards me. So, so it's not weird. It's not yeah. weird. It's it's good actually. It's good now. Thank you. I'm gonna draw so many spikes. Why did I do this? <laughs> I could have picked any other card, but I had to be honest. We appreciate your honesty, Nathan. I just love Destroyer. Every time I get him in my hand, I get, I get so excited. I'm like, ooh, this is going to be a Destroyer game. I can feel it. Nathan, we still got to do a snap stream at some point. Well, I, I'm waiting for them to make it so that uh, you can do like friendly battles against your against your friends. Oh, that's not a feature. No. It's still early access, and they don't have that in yet. But when they do, oh. it's on site. It's on the site, the website. The website. Marvelsnap.com. Marvelsnap.biz. Slash fight Nathan. Fight night. You get it. He's got lots of spikes. Gonna make me draw all these spikes. <laughs> you get it, you know. You know how it is. Sometimes I look at someone like a destroyer and I'm like, you really can't do much else normal. With like the way that you are, you can yeah. kinda only destroy. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's kind of it's your whole bag. <laughs> All destroyer does is destroy. <laughs> Can't even destroy eat hot chip. Hot chip <laughs> destroy phone. <laughs> I don't know if he can lie or not. I don't know if he even speaks. Destroy truth. <laughs> I just i I love the like the narratives you get when you're playing Marvel Snap, though. Like the idea that destroyer would destroy everything except there's a dog. There's a space dog. There's a space dog, so he won't. And he, see, he sees the space dog, and he's like, actually, not this time. Yeah. I Why would you? I won't destroy. There's a dog No here. one should be able to destroy the space dog. <laughs> not only will I not destroy the space dog, I won't destroy anything. Anyway... Um, I, I won't say play Marvel Snap because it, it will take up too much of your time unless you have better self-control than me. Up for debate. But, you <laughs> know what? I probably do is the thing. Have better self-control than me? Absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to give myself the credit, but I know it's true. Yeah. I then just me, don't have an, an addictive then me, Nathan, personality. Well, good for y'all. Congrats. Like I was talking with friends yesterday, and it's like, oh, I'm still trying to 100% Hades. And I'm like, y'all play video games for like a really long time. Y'all can focus on more than one video game at a time? Yeah, I, I usually years? play just like a little. I like to have like video game sampler platter. Mm, where I'm just see, like, Give me, let me just I, take a little taste. I think that's cool, but that is just my brain does not work that way. And I'm kind of jealous. Well, I'm I can kind of only jealous play. Of the other way. I can only play one game at a time. I wish I could extract that much value out of one game, but my brain <laughs> will not allow me to play a game for that long. It's like, you have to do something else now. You can't play this one anymore. <laughs> I'm like, okay, guess I'll play a different one then. Yeah. I did get all four endings in Digimon Survive. I finished oh, nice. the Digi uh, Encyclopedia in Digimon Cyber Sleuth, which I'm just like, <laughs> I really poured hundreds of hours into grinding. <laughs> I that's, did it. That's what it's for. 
I love a grind. It is kind of nice. I do like a, a, a game that has something I can do while I'm like watching YouTube videos. Yeah. Did you see that like Vampire Survivors Mobile came out? I heard. It came out on mobile now. Wow. That's the the auto battler. Yeah. Like the not auto battler, but like auto. I mean, it is. It does auto battle, but. Right. But that's. It's I like, know what you mean. You know what I mean. But yes. Cool. But that's a, that's a dangerous one to have in your pocket at all times. Yeah. Because you can pull out one hand and, and walk around anytime. Letting your dude do do his dirty business to those vampires. I'm in four figures for playtime in Animal Crossing. Yeah, me too. <laughs> I think that's normal. I choose to believe that's normal. I remember one time I tweeted a picture of like my Switch making fun of me for on, for not not playing enough uh, ring fit to even register like an hour amount, it just said like a little while. <laughs> <laughs> and most of the comments I got were about how little I played Animal Crossing. <laughs> You're not image. an Animal Crossing kind of guy. No, I played a little and was like, okay. At least you know now that it's not yeah. for you. Yeah. It's for me. Yeah. <laughs> I love slow paced games that require no skill <laughs> or reaction time. I mean, just I don't a like, lot of knowledge and patience. <laughs> I don't like reaction time games either, but I need more needs to happen in Fair. them. Yeah. You know, you said fair, but I'm looking at this bear. So I heard bear. 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 <laughs> Bear. 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 Yeah, I still need to play Hades. I just keep not doing it because I know it's going to be like a game I have to actually learn how to play. And I just have other games I'm playing and I can't focus on more than one game at a time. <laughs> Bear. 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 I am finally catching up on animes. But that too, I that's why I watch so much dubbed anime is because if I watch it while I'm working, I need it to be in English or else I'm going to miss it completely. Right. Yeah, that's true. I can only Sometimes... watch subs if I'm like just actually sitting there, which I'm not usually doing. Sometimes I'll be watching a, a subs anime and like go to check my phone during the end credits and then <laughs> forget that I'm watching a subs anime and the next episode will start and I'll be still looking at my phone and then be like a ways into it and be like, oh, oh, the next episode started. Oh, I shit. guess I got to start <laughs> over. Whoops. I saw I... Uh, Datya in chat say, meanwhile, I keep picking up Souls games and Monster Hunters and never getting very far. <laughs> While those are like the two game types of games I play a shit ton of the game that I keep buying every one of and then not playing is Xenoblade Chronicles. I keep every time there's a new one, I buy it and I'm like, this time I'm gonna like Xenoblade Chronicles. I do it with Fire Emblem too. Wow. I buy them and I'm like, this is the Fire Emblem that I'm really gonna get into. And then I play it for like three hours and I'm like, I don't like Fire Emblem. <laughs> <laughs> Why do I keep buying these? I actually don't like this one, but I feel compelled to try every time. Yeah. <laughs> is there is there a World Cup game happening right now? Because uh, my neighbors are going absolutely bananas. There I, might be. Probably. I can't, uh, I can't think of what other like thing would be. it's kind of late in the day, though. Yeah, I don't know. There is. Yes, Something... there is. Okay. Okay. okay, that makes sense. I can't keep track of I don't. I can't happening. think of any other thing that I keep would be forgetting happening it's that would happening elicit this response. Because it's like off season this year so it's in a I'm penalty like, shootout that would explain uh, why people are getting hyped oh, oh shit who's playing yeah what are we at are we still in this round of 16 
I only get updates once a week because the only person who talks about this shit is my dad. I think we're in the round of eight now. Oh, shit. Because we've, we've been watching some oh. of it here and there. Argentina versus Netherlands. Ooh. Ooh. Good. I used wow. to be so fucking obsessed with the World Cup, but... Netherlands are the ones yeah. that knocked the U.S. out this year, right? Yeah. Yeah. They killed us. We deserve it. Yeah. And we said US thank is, you. you are yeah. Y'all, U.S. Are, is never good. Yeah. <laughs> But are y'all of the opinion that if you get knocked out of a tournament, you want the the person who the team that knocked you out to go on to win it, so you got beaten by the best, or are you petty and just want them to lose next? Because fuck them. I don't care. I just like watching soccer. But if you were the team that lost, huh? which would you want? Mm. I'm trying to put myself in the brain of when I used to play competitive soccer and I'm just like, I literally don't care. It just means I don't have to drive out to Beaumont again tomorrow. <laughs> so. <laughs> <laughs> That's so funny. I'm happy. I want them to win because they saved me from having to drive out to Beaumont. <laughs> yeah. Bro, that's a long drive. Well, I'm not driving, but one of my parents is, and they're not happy about it either. Got to wake up early. <laughs> when I was playing tennis in high school, um, the worst types of matches for me were the ones that were really close between me and the opponent. Because as it like got towards the end, the pressure would just get too much. Yeah. And so I would be like, I think I'm just going to lose so that I don't have to. Damn like be dealing with this stress yeah, anymore. Yeah, that's a lot of pressure. <laughs> At least with soccer, you the whole bunch of you that the pressure can fall on. Yeah. I just remember a specific match where I was like in my mind I was like I could probably win this if I really put my whole ass into it. But also but this is really stressing me out and so yeah. I think I'm just going to lose. But make it look convincing. Yeah. I don't. I don't think the shading is gonna get any. It looks better. cool. Yeah, it's looking good. I'm gonna, yeah. I'm just gonna yeah, give him some of these action lines. Real some good. Dust because of all the destroying he did. Yeah. Look at you doing so much destroying. Well. Will you? Aren't you a big guy? Oh, my cat's going crazy on me. Thank you, Olive. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. I really stopped paying attention to the World Cup because the general politics of it are kind of the oh, yeah. older I get. But it's also because what was the year? I want to say it was like 20. Yeah. Yeah. 2010. The year with fucking Paul the Octopus and like all that shit. And I was like also on the very end of my Hitalia phase. So it was just like the wildest fucking year to be really into like <laughs> international soccer. <laughs> just like, what? Julia. Julia? That, are those some Julia coughs I hear? Aww. It was Julia yelling, presumably at the soccer game and then coughing. You're like a dumbass. <laughs> Did it to herself. Dang. Had to do it to him. And by them, I mean me. <laughs> Had to do it to me. Had to do it to me. <laughs> Who's she, she rooting, rooting for? for? I don't know. <laughs> Ask her. <laughs> I don't know who she's rooting for. Ask her. She's 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 rooting for. Julia, <laughs> who are you rooting for? Who am I rooting for? Yeah, the Netherlands. The Netherlands. Nice. So she's she's of the mind that we Orange. should we should lose to the to the winner. To the, to There's the winner. nothing to be in the mind for. U.S. isn't a good international team. <laughs> They're always going to lose. But what if we won instead? <laughs> no, if, it's just never going to happen. <laughs> what if one time, what yeah, if just, just once. this once? <laughs> no. Just this once. <laughs> That's why the running joke is US wins 0 to 0. <laughs> 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 uh. 
I bet next time we'll win. Yeah. U.S. Yeah, women's soccer sure. is strong. Men's soccer, mm. not a, not so strong. Not so much. Mm-hmm. Yeah, oh, the, the women can happened. get it. Some happened. They're going crazy. Oh, They're going shit. crazy in the next apartment. <laughs> <laughs> Is that the game? Did it end? Apparently so. We should, okay. for every sporting event, do a live stream where we put people watching it like two rooms away <laughs> and then just like comment on how much noise they're making. Yeah. I could keep working on this forever, but I'm going to stop. I mean, we have four more minutes if you want to keep working on it. I'm not drawing anything else. Um, okay. Just leave enough time for poor foe. Yeah. yeah. Leave room for Porf. Leave room for Porf. Yeah, I guess this is the last Patreon bonus stream of the year. Thanks for another year Whoa. of support, everybody. You're right. Yeah. Wow. It's really wild to me that we're already at the end of the year. This one felt like such a long one and yet so fast. Yeah. And it's wild to me that people have continued to support us for a whole wow. nother year. <laughs> What's that like? <laughs> Just letting us continue doing this. <laughs> if you stop supporting us, we would have to stop doing this. Yeah. It's in your yeah. hands. Yeah. So thanks no for pressure or anything. Let me make it more like years. Cute. People are like honking and screaming outside. So yeah. Damn. I imagine ne- some stuff's going on. Did the Netherlands win? That would be That's the upset, not right? What I saw. Okay, well then, I don't know. I guess my my neighbors were Argentina fans. Yeah. Because Ju- Julie is not whooping and hollering, so. <laughs> <laughs> Barbarian boys that I've been here since 2016, and y'all can't get rid of my support. Incredible. Oh, shit. Thank thank you so much. But <laughs> thank we'll you find so a much. <laughs> well. We'll, we'll alienate you somehow. Maybe. Yeah. <laughs> Eventually. Don't worry. <laughs> there will come a day where it just won't make sense anymore. But until like, then. I can no longer in good consciousness. Conscience yeah. says. Conscience. Oh, no. Says, he's starting. <laughs> while I'm conscious, I can't support this channel. But yeah, it really, it really means a lot. It's uh, it's all I know how to do at this point. So, <laughs> yeah, it would be pretty rough if we had to stop doing it. Because then we'd still, have to like, like learn a trade or something. I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. I cannot be hired by yeah. anyone. It it we become less hireable the more yeah. time that goes on yeah. that we're doing like, this. I've been I've been too silly so far yeah. Yeah. i have sorry no real world <laughs> like contributions to bring we've got your resume is very impressive and uh we we really like uh we really liked you in the interview but um we checked you're, your you're your references silly. You're just, you've been too silly and we, we just think you're too silly for this this company this is not really a silly company yeah yeah just a little bit too silly for us yeah you think you think they would have hired me full-time at college humor if i made that penis sillier and not more realistic that's a good point (laughs) that if you had come back to me with a real (laughs) silly penis after i gave you that that note i would have been like okay respect i guess it has to be silly (laughs) oh no she's pushing boundaries (laughs) (laughs) no i was wrong I mean, I was just always in a panic giving notes on articles because I was like, these these artists I know what they're doing. Known. I knew nothing about you. I thought you were California based, which is why I was always so confidently sending out my drafts at 4 a.m. <laughs> the day they were due. <laughs> I mean, I may as well have been California based. I wasn't checking anything until the afternoon. Hey. <laughs> I remember like my earliest freelance articles I did took me so long and I worked so hard to get them done for for something that I look at them now and I'm like that that's like I don't remember 30 minutes that's like 30 minutes of work max yeah for today and your your line quality was 
It was rough. <laughs> it was rough. <laughs> it was rough stuff. Yeah. I forgot if we ever talked about how when I freelanced, I still worked for BuzzFeed and I worked for an animation studio and I would pull all nighters if the three deadlines lined up on the same day. Oh my gosh. So I would stay up all night finishing my BuzzFeed stuff and then finishing the college humor stuff. And then I would just go into work at the studio. It was God. 10 to 7. And um, to keep myself awake, I would because they didn't have like a full fucking startup kitchen like they did at like college humor. I would go to the water cooler, which was very cold. Thankfully, I would pour myself a cup of cold water and I would hold it in my mouth while I worked. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> to Karina, keep myself awake. This is so sad. This is the saddest you, story ever. Because sometimes I would you be like, "You just shading. asked me for an extension." <laughs> no, I wasn't. I didn't know you. And so I would be like shading, because I I was a cleanup artist. So I'd be doing rim lighting on something, and I remember I would fall asleep while I was doing it, and I'd wake up and I'd be like. Ah, oh, shit. I did this whole shot wrong because <laughs> I did it with my eyes closed. So that's why I started doing the water thing. Because then if I fell asleep, I would like spill water all over. <laughs> oh, my God. What a nightmare. Uh, the early, my early 20s. <laughs> wow. Incredible. Well, thank you all Beautiful. for the support. Yeah. So Always that we no longer have to like that. <laughs> I'm doing draw class next Friday. If you're oh, in yeah. that, boy, at that, what are tier. you doing? If you know, I don't know for sure yet. I think awesome. I might do like, um, like how to, to like analyze and break down like professional Ooh. art, like Ooh. how to how to learn from professional art, maybe something I, like that. All right, cool. well, I'll I'll sit in on that one for sure. We can learn together. I I learned so much. From the draw classes from y'all, I love them. Yeah, they're fun. Oh, Any anytime I like am too busy to be the the second chair on one or or too sick or whatever, I'm always like disappointed because I I really enjoy them. Hell yeah! Well, you can be there, Nathan. I and will. We'll, we'll both learn. <laughs> I'll be there, and the destroyer ah. will be there. <laughs> hey. hey. We're sorry. We're sorry. Sorry. Bye bye. Bye. It's it's over.